Rinpoche, at this point, we would like to thank you on behalf of everybody here. It has been really an extraordinary blessing to have had such profound instructions from a master such as you. For you are widely recognized, respected, as a highly accomplished master of Mahamudra and Dzogchen. Not only that, but also we deeply appreciate the significance of your being among us as you also represent <laughs> the great Jigong Kagyu practice lineage, the great living lineage of Jigong Chopa, Jigong Songa. <laughs> and here, we all feel very strongly the spirit of Rime, <laughs> the Rime spirit, which uh, Rinpoche has taught to us, inspired by his own masters, Jamin Kenzi Chogi Lodru and Dingo Kenzi Rinpoche. And so you feel unusually close to our hearts. Not only that, but also we, as you know, are all following the Dzogchen Longchen Nitik lineage of Padra Rinpoche. And so for us here at this point in our three-year retreat, it has been extraordinarily meaningful to have received this teaching of Tsiksom Nedek. In the lineage of pith instructions from Kempong Mensel, who received it from Kempong Achong. And so this is of the greatest significance for us. All of us have found your teachings, Rinpoche, incredibly clear and precise, easy to understand, And to put them into practice, we understand that that is our responsibility. But also, we're amazed at how you bring together the wisdom of Zopa Tempo with the love and compassion of Bodhicitta. We all feel, all of us, that you are kind of absolutely shining or overflowing with love and bodhicitta. And the last few days, you know, the sun outside has been extremely strong. <laughs> but 
but here inside this temple, <laughs> here inside the temple, we've definitely got the feeling that your love and your joy seem even brighter. So we're all getting a bodhicitta santan. <laughs> and it is true, Rinpoche, that since you first arrived here, we all connected, all 1,500 of us, all connected immediately with you, like you were a member of our family coming home. Also, we are really deeply inspired and moved by you, Rinpoche, to know that despite the hardship of your years in prison, you overcome, you overcame suffering through acceptance of karma, and you transformed it into a source of realization and compassion. You are actually a living tribute or example to the power of the Dharma. An example of, but I add to you, example of how, um, like Rinpoche is a great example, and many of the lamas, you see, even under the great tragedy of what happened under Chinese occupation, overcame to the power of Dharma. So Rinpoche, while you have been here with us, we've experienced you as having the ability of a true master to share the most profound instructions in the most essential, powerful way, going directly to our hearts. And so we are deeply grateful. And we pray for your long life and for all of your aspirations. And also please keep us, all of us, in your heart and in your prayers and in your prayer wheel. And please return again to Lerabling in the future.
I think what Patrick said, uh, maybe nothing uh, much is to be added. Patrick should say, you tell Jargo as a magic mandu. Te yina ti kaki jibi, not mache. Tarindaga pet to too loud. This one. Tarindaga pet to a te hindu kati chirumbachi. Tinone bagita chick namtar mumbu mune kuchu. Te yina yon tal lama mumma tarinje to so. I've said I've had many wonderful stories about mache, but it's wonderful to see in person very much. Thank you, but but Tari Rumbuchi Kachisu, Human Hatu Taz Nebri, Tari Rumbuchi Kachinos, the Rumbuchi wrote to our Dangomatan and Jonchu. So it's a wonderful Lama, and really, I mean, as you can see, he holds the great lineage of uh, both the Dragon Kagyu and true Campbell Munsell. In fact, Campbell Munsell, for example, has spoken very much spoke about him and said that he was astonished at Rinpoche's accomplishment. Where is Gyume? Uh, <laughs> and he was astonished at Rinpoche's accomplishment and said that he was really an emanation of a great uh, bodhisattva. So, um, And here I want to kind of uh, say a few words. It's from a student of mine. Her name is an Allison, whose photograph is being shown now. Uh, she says, uh, uh, she actually captures what everybody feels. Huh? And he, he, she says, he radiates, Rinpoche radiates warmth and kindness. And the strength of his compassion is such that we can feel his love and wisdom just by being in his presence. I'm here to only repeat what Alison said. <laughs> She's probably cringing at this moment. He has a he has a softness and gentle, joyful humor. He has a softness and gentle, joyful humor. He embodies bodhicitta in his being, which penetrates our hearts. He's teaching, his teachings are imbued with bodhicitta at every moment, reminding us that this great, I'll give you time, first I've said, uh, his teaching are imbued with bodhicitta at every moment, reminding us that this great love for all beings is the heart of the practice of the heart of enlightenment. So I think that captures the essence of what he said, isn't it? Patrick is there. So, Jesus, Meko. Jesus, come and teach. So, really, uh, just in session, then the Rumbaji Tarinda Rape, the Tanga to Kasu, Chinder, that Tito Rumbaji system, the Manga, the Tusamanga, known to Bate, then Chindu Kadin, Chicho, and Yirumbaji, the name Rumbaji, could say Hape. I'm saying the sense that, you know, it's been wonderful that he's been so kind to grant us this extraordinary teaching of Sikshu Nadek, uh, and that uh, we made this very special connection with him. 
and so that I pray that he may live long, his all his works, and and the Tarki Jepeting at Jundung at to Nanaka at to Kandem Momondone, to the cups of Monom Huchovich, then bring it in the cups of Huchovich. And then main thing is that he live long, because he kept that Lord Jato Nishitanga, but you there just 125 years. He says he's 74, he's quite old, but no, not old at all, he's very young. And then also the young young pen I thought that one of the greatest teachings, besides his wonderful teachings, is the testimony that when he was under Chinese prison for 20 years, not only him, but many of the lamas, but he is here actually alive, coming to demonstrate that. That after the incredible suffering that you go through in the Chinese prison, not really. It's quite intense. He said he felt no suffering at all. Why? Because he accepted that it's part of one's karma. It's because of due to karma. That acceptance of karma, a, a past karma, I mean, you recognize that and then say no suffering. And I thought that was the greatest teaching. That's something we all have to remember, you know? I mean, uh, since you are not in any, anything like the Chinese prisons, so you should have no suffering at all. You should all be joyful, happy. From they just a tiny zone, they coron to some other. Same the kind of change, maybe rambicik di, so the young, because the kind of people they are working with do. Kind of the rambicik, then the rambicik kung ari chamber chuna yong, then leng teg ngi le, yi gong di kasi then dung ari chuna majum berba. Kotol the kind of tamo yom berba. They just tiny zone, the kind of change, maybe chaf chidi. So from this you learn that you have no suffering anymore from this. There's just a rumbuch in the pain, eh? Coronto non jungoma, the tiny chunks of Ganga Chenny Mepa, Ganga Karchuna Ting, Hemeg laying, but the Kennedy's day, Chingy Ba. Gang in Namtoris. He said, Gang in Namtoris said, Suffering is just one's mind, thoughts. Right? So that I think is what, what the most important message is. Right? So, I'd also like to thank, as well, a Lama Tsering Rinpoche, who studied uh, and completed many years of retreat at the Gaal Monastery in Kham, East Tibet, and is now the resident Lama at Gachen Rinpoche Center in Munich, as well as Lama Abu and Lama Punima, who have served Gachen Rinpoche from an early age as his attendants and assistants, at first in the Gaal Monastery in Tibet, but then also since 1997 on his international travels. Didn't Dino launching good year and chancer on butch, then go chancer on butch, you ran my hill. You can keep it. The Nalatini, young him put to the Tonde Lagar song, which is to chancer song, Tonde Pata Tom and Deep Botany, the general butch, then go chancer and Pata's Deep Year and Butch, and so did it. Then the other that Cooper had you written which is that Rumbutch, young him put it at the Chamberji goes and at the Chamberji little bit left up. Yanni put the temperance as a chamber, you go shook the lella. Chamber thing is a zone of pion, the neck, not than the chimney pump gown chains on both the rear, which that is the last look at the church. The tata da, the docker term which you tat to run the gas in the young chimney thing. Cutting chair, which cutting chair, then make a bit, then the chair is a thing. Then be gender. Then by your name,
Now I become the holder of Jugunka Gulinet. <laughs> and bring the Guru Mitya. <laughs> quick, quick, quick. Satin. Tembe Jenda. Naton Jovac. Tembe. And also, one thing to say that Rinpoche is, the, I think, one of the most dynamic teachers. Rinpoche is the most dynamic teacher in the Dragon Kagyu tradition. He's great help for Dragon Chamgyu Rinpoche. And also, I know from Ogin Tobgya Rinpoche, from uh, Gary Rinpoche, and many others, that in Nanchen and the whole Kham region, he is one of the most respected lamas. Thank you, Dukaslata. And Dragon Kagyu, no, 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 Tembala ta chalen nangke shu chen bade che rendu ch. Then jam gu nang bade ni na che penda ru nang gores. Riba ro te ran riba. Then nong chen de bade gya ren bade ojen to bje kuzong ma song gu du. Nong chen shu zong ma de. Then lama ten den che sa de che ri shu du. Then ta ren bade den bje gu de ngu ren bade che de che. That that chen de kyo. I'm a pig, I'm a pig. I'm a pig. You should pig. I'm a pig. Yeah, you should be a pig. Remove the Let do the, uh, the Western chant. Do that. The Quran is a chizarik donchiril. Dumak tebat. Yeah. No, no, no. I, who knows? Yes. I don't think give anybody marker too strong in bed. They don't press the way. Chant <laughs> Chant, <laughs> 
Tori Lamrima la Chamsa, Tundri Lamrima la Chamsa, Ninsong Gongama la Chamsa, Ninsong Gongama la Chamsa, Tata Chechi, Tong Barnze, Church, Tata Chuchi, Tong Barnze, Papa Ropachi, Nasu, Tata Chechi, Tong Barnze, I don't took each up the soul, I don't took each up the soul. Georgia Atisha, Nasu, Lamasel, but then the Pep Dutini. This is the Mrs. Hazard. This is when Atisha visited Serlingpa, teacher. He had a vision of Tara, and he composed this very powerful prayer. Tichik Dima. Tadachi I want to say this Lama here, Lama, and these Lamas also, I came to know these Lamas, they're really wonderful, really very genuine and very wonderful. And uh, really wonderful. Thank you very much. Thank you. And this Anila, we're going to exchange. They wanted maybe exchange with Anil Tamchu sometimes. <laughs> and then Liana here, who's really been Rinpoche, serving Rinpoche very much in his work. Thank you very much. So, uh, uh, Philip, Philip, have this prayer of Tara right now. Uh, this very special prayer of Tara, maybe we should write it down. We do it as part of our practice with by Atisha. Very good. Okay. All right, now uh, for the... No, no. Can you don't whisper? Uh, we need the... Uh, 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 where's that? Who's translator? Uh, this uh, Scottish. Nina, I need your vibrancy here. Because she just said, uh, Get me, Nina. Or oh, Patrick, tell me. Or oh, Rosie, 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 Rosie here. Rosie? Yeah, Rosie, come here, Rosie. Rosie, come here, Rosie. Yeah, jump over, jump over, jump over, jump over all these people. Jump over, especially Robert. <laughs> yeah, jump over, jump over, yeah, everything. Yeah, jump over, yeah. <coughs> Bless them all. <laughs> yeah, come. No, 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 yeah, 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 come next. No, 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 but just, just tell me. Yeah. She so tomorrow no, morning. No, no. What she said, you tell me. So first of all, you have lunch break now.
for two hours. So you come back at? Okay, come back at three. Okay, to our lunch break. Okay, now tomorrow, uh, Kachinbich is leaving at nine o'clock. So please, the three year retreatants and anyone else who'd like to say goodbye to him, uh, come and line up uh, tomorrow with scarves, and then you can just wave like this, okay? <laughs> Saying goodbye. And uh, you can maybe say, well, kutsi shabete at the time. And njoku uh, please come soon, okay? That's one thing, these two terms. The scholars will give you that. And uh, then, um, what else? In terms of what's tomorrow's schedule? Uh, when are the everybody coming? Uh, would many of you want to come back, say goodbye tomorrow or not? Yes. So then you come at nine o'clock tomorrow. <laughs> okay. Uh, huh? No, no, no. You come at 8.45, and then the program will begin at nine tomorrow. And with that means we can end a little bit quicker in the, in the evening, okay? When you come early, we can end early. Uh, uh, we can end earlier. When you come a little bit later, we end a little bit later. So tomorrow the programs will go back to normal, uh, which means that I'll be teaching, <laughs> unfortunately for you. Uh, so uh, we'll begin. I will, uh, and of course also I'm teaching this afternoon. Could be around five o'clock. Five o'clock, yeah? Okay, five o'clock, just come. That's good. Five o'clock this afternoon. Three o'clock you come back. There is some important presentation. And then uh, five o'clock I will teach, or even earlier. All right? And then tomorrow you come at nine, and I'll be teaching also in the morning. There's a possibility I may teach also tomorrow afternoon, just to see, okay? So because I have not taught so much, uh, so that we feel maybe, yes. And then we will begin today showing the, the homage in the Tsiksum Nedek. The homage is quite extraordinary. And we've showed the first one uh, to the Longchen Rabja, homage Longchen Rabja, which is the view of Dokwa Chimpo. Now the meditation in Kento Ezer and action in Gyaran Yoga, these two will be shown today. It's quite in depth that teaching, you know. So maybe when that's being shown, if you can uh, put the text on the screen so that they can read the text while they hear the teachings, that'll be good, isn't it? It will help more. All right? So we better use the screen, like using showing Allison's picture. Think of it. <laughs> that was just for a joke, anyway. Anyway. So thank you, everybody, and go and have a, a good lunch. <laughs>